Hola, como estamos? Welcome to the Awesome is Joy channel. My name is Joy and today I'd like to introduce you to a few products and a couple of brands that I really, really love. So, first, I'd love to start out by introducing you to my BH Cosmetics collection. Now, I know that you've seen some of these already and that is definitely because I have been working on this channel for a while and I've been collecting makeup. But let's talk about it anyway because who can get enough of this Marvin Korn? Right now I'm going to talk about BH Cosmetics. Um, I love this palette. It's so much fun. To me, it's really not too much. I mean, it has Mm, five mattes and five glitters and then it has blush and bronzer. You can use this any way you want to obviously but I really really love this product. Um, when I bought this product I was able to get it with the BH Cosmetic uh, 12 piece brush set. The crystal quartz and I haven't opened it all this time waiting and I love the packaging um so let's see what we have inside OMG I see a stippling brush I see powder brush Stippling brush. Oh, brush is falling. <laughs> All over brush. Oh my goodness, there are brushes for days. Anyway, nonetheless, I will be able to include the description and information on um, these products on the bottom here. Um, but when I got, like, the brush set right now, um, because of Memorial Day, but you'll probably see this after that, um, is $26 for this set, and, um, the, um, Marvin Corn is actually $17.50 regular price, so I was able to get them on sale for $30, which was totally awesome, but I think the product and, um, the color and the, um, the give back is really great with these products, so I think you should definitely look into these. Now we can go on to something that I was really excited to see. Um, I was on the fence about getting it because it was just really amazing and a lot. Um, weekend Festival. Weekend Festival came out with 20 color shadow palette. It came out with eye toppers. There was a blush set. It was, well, a brush set. Oh, I said blush set. Look at these colors. Okay, so I love the fact that there's a mirror. Love a mirror. But there are actually enough neutral shades and enough fun glittery shades, there are some mattes, to get you through a long weekend. Go have some fun. And um, I'm going to do a swatch on, ooh, Zippy. Let's see what Zippy looks like. Giving me so much life. Oh my gosh. Swag. Here's swag. Ah. Okay, so this is why I needed this palette. I really, really needed it. But then I discovered that BH Cosmetics came out with eye toppers. So the eye lights, they call them eye lights. I got a fresh gnarly and gal pal they also sell four others called psych bfs 
and um, rather three others, and chill pill. So um, I would like to swatch these for you. This is gnarly. This is gnarly. <laughs> this is the color. That giggle was my daughter. And look at this. Hmm. <laughs> I have to say the tip is cool. Um, I really like being able to use um, stick shadows, liquid shadows. Um, it's fantastic. The color, these three together would be freaking awesome. Um, I also have fresh. This is the color. And I believe that this one actually looks more yellow than gold. Let's see. Mm. Let's see. I don't know. Oh my goodness. Gold? Yellow? Gold. Oh my gosh. I would use this by itself. <laughs> I really want it. Um, and then we have Gal Pal. Gal Pal, I feel like she's going to be more bronzy, goldish, fantastic with the tan. Or not. Here we are. Oh, my. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That was a need. I think it's still a need. I think it's still a need. And then, while I was strolling through the website, I found a collection called Glam Reflections. There are four in the collection. We're going to go through them. Okay, um, the first one is L'Amour. Now, this is a 15 color palette. And these colors are actually quite neutral. It's a neutral palette. Um, it does give me more of a hint of greenish and um, some shimmers. I definitely love this color. It is amazing. Um, I think it's definitely worth having. They feel quite creamy actually uh we're going to start down here i don't know the names of these colors but it doesn't say on the back look at that i think that's an awesome look and these are on sale right now for eleven dollars and seventy cents so this is lamore I think that to be a neutral, a neutral palette. And then there's Gilded. Pretty packaging, isn't it pretty? I love that it shines. At least fingerprints too, so you gotta wipe it down. Hmm. This says Autumn to me. What do we think? Oh my goodness. I have to try that orange. Like I said, I waited to be able to share this with you guys before I touched it. So everything's like stuck together. Look at that. Let's try this tangerine color. It's so this summer and uh, I think it's OPI that sells a fantastic tangerine color. I have that is Sally Hansen. But look. At what we have. Is that not fantastic? Fantastic. I think it's definitely worth it. I think it works well with 
the L'Amour palette and I think it also works well alone. So I'm starting to think that all four of these palettes would be able to work together and be interchangeable and the, they're very soft and they go from creamy to powder and um, the price point is fantastic. So that is definitely a yes for me on Gilded. We have now Rosé. Rosé. Let's see if I'm correct. Oh my goodness. Now this palette is mostly matte where I found that the Gilded and um, the L'Amour had a lot more of the um, glitter going on. I love the neutral palette, but I definitely, definitely think that this is just a color that you should put in your corner crease. Look at that. I think you should definitely corner crease that. I think you should definitely use that as an accent. Use it as a liner. Um, I dare say that I might mix a little bit of this with a little bit of that. These two colors here and turn it into a highlight. I love it. I love it. Um, and my last one in this collection is Smoke. This one. Look at those colors. Look at those blues. Look at that green. And the beauty of the green is that it comes... Look at that. And then there's a shimmer color. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I think that's actually... It looks green. It looks black. But it definitely has shimmer to it. Oh, there's so much you can do with this. The smoky eyes, uh, the daytime smoky for work. Uh, definitely be able to do a fantastic cut crease with these. I think all together they were um, definitely worth the value. Um, definitely the pigmentation is there. And um, I really think that these were a great purchase. So you might really want to look online and check out BH Cosmetics because... I have, and I kind of ticked it for a while there. I still love BH Cosmetics. Um, I would also like to talk to you about one other company that I have found to be something that I really love. I really like to use their product, and that is Makeup Revolution London. I initially found out about Makeup Revolution London from TJ Maxx, and... Um, Marshall. I used to like pass it by and go, meh, because it wasn't a higher end product. But then um, I bought actually this palette, Girls on Film. And this palette is really like an everyday go to palette. Um, I definitely love this color I've been digging in here. Um, I go for this color a lot. Um, it's so worth it. And I think I paid four dollars for this palette from um, Marshalls. I had to get a couple of these. And then I saw on a haul selfie hashtag hashtag selfie. See? Can you see that? Cutie. Hashtag selfie. And I thought this was cute. Because it has shimmers, it has smoky eye, it has daytime, it has rosé, it has all those lovely colors, and it is in a tiny purse, comfortable packaging, and also it has a full mirror. 
Um, the brushes, don't discount, don't discount these. These are actually great if you spray them with a little bit of water and use them on the shimmer colors. Uh, this was three dollars. I got this for three dollars. Wait, I got this for three dollars. Yep, three dollars at TJ Maxx. Now, I got this for four dollars at TJ Maxx. Um, I checked online. They still sell these. It's called uh, Protection. Um, online right now I noticed that they have medium and um, medium dark. I happen to have the light medium. I don't know how I'm going to open this. I have the light medium here. But uh, the beauty of this product is that it has blending concealers. It has highlight, it has blushes, it has everything you're going to need all day long. Um, it even has a powder to take away the shine and mattify if you need the anti-shine. I do. Um, I tend to have, I have combo skin, but I definitely tend to have oily in my T-zone. Um, my first time opening this and I wanted to wait to open it with you guys because I've never seen it and the price is so fantastic. Oh, let's see. How hard is it? <gasps> Look how pretty. Oh, they're so pretty. So these are so okay. So these are the concealers that you have to work with. Um, this is your setting powder or throughout the day just pat down powder. These, this is your blush, this is your highlighter, and this is your contour. I think that you can mix and match it however you want, but for the price, who can beat it? And um, I believe that online right now, mm, they're going for about $14 for a palette, but this has everything in it, so I think it's worth it. Um, I think maybe I'll do a video using this. Now, I actually went to Ulta, and Ulta sells Makeup Revolution, Makeup Revolution London, and I found the Flawless 4, number 4 palette. It has 32 colors. Oh, yay! And it came with a color sheet. Okay, so I have to say right off the back, right off the bat, uh, palette whistle, love, <laughs> not today. I would love to have the job of naming colors. Whoever has that job, it must be so much fun. Um, this one is statement on top, baby, which is really cute. It's, it's mauve it's a nice color. Um, ouch. <laughs> Blend. Work it. Garnet. I'm not going to swatch these right now because I'm definitely going to do a video on these. But um, I definitely want to take a minute and just show you some of my favorite um, drugstore brand and um, stuff that you can definitely find at Target and Marshalls and not have to break the bank for. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, I can't wait to talk to you guys again. See you soon.